Now then, the time has come to show you who I truly am. So here is where I have to go to get some type of a fortune of some kind to get that glider. Ooh. Oh, there's a trial, huh? All right. I've yet to be able to complete one of these. Maybe this one I will. Can't be that difficult. Famous last words. Give me a little tear. Come on. What do I get? What you got for me? Oh, there we go. Magnesis. Manipulate metallic objects using magnetism. Grab onto a metallic object using this magnetic energy that pours forth from the magnesis ruin. Objects held in the magnetic snare can be lifted a pop up and moved freely. Somehow I'm probably gonna have to use that during this trial somehow. I don't know how. Whoa! Wow! All right, let's go down. Intro, I don't even know how I did that. How did, how did I do that? Oh, that would have hurt if that hit me. Ah, alright, I got it, I got it, I got it. Interesting. I like it. I like it. I like it. Hey, Satan! Well, I'm glad I destroyed that quickly. I believe what I gotta do...
Come on, you want to turn around a little bit? That'll work. How do I get up there? No. I don't know how you get that though, not yet. No creatures or or something trying to kill me. What could this be? Hello? Hello? You have proven to possess the resolve of a true hero. I am Oman O, the creator of this trial. I am a humble monk, blessed with the sight of Goddess Halaya, and dedicated to helping those who seek out. Da -da 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 -da. And with your arrival, my duty is now fulfilled. I cannot rest in peace. In the name of the goddess of Ahalaya, allow me to bestow this gift upon you. Please accept this spirit orb. What if I deny it? I think I'll take it. Why not? Awesome! May the goddess smile upon you. Bye! Oh, man! Oh! Santa's back! Hey, Santa! It seems you managed to get your hands on a spirit orb. Well done! <laughs> Clairvoyance! Oh, or perhaps just something similar. As one gets older, it can become more difficult to see what is right before one's own eyes. However, that which was once hidden from view can often be crystal clear. <laughs> but perhaps that is not true for everyone! Ho <laughs> ho! The appearance of those towers and the awakening of this shrine. Hmm. It is all connected to that Shakika slate you carry on your hip. Shakira, Shakira. Uh, Sh Shika? I don't know. Whatever. What do you mean? Hmm. It's been quite some time since I have seen that Shika slate. Long ago. A highly advanced tribe known as the Shika inhabited these island, these lands. The great power of their wisdom saved this kingdom time and time again. But their ancient technology disappeared long ago, or so it is said. It is interesting, however, to think how something like that survived all this time, hidden away in a shrine. These shrines are tucked away in numerous places all across this land. Or this plateau alone. On this plateau alone. On this plateau alone. I believe there are still three more. <laughs> Bring me the treasure from each of those shrines and I will give you my paraglider. So I need more now? 
I said treasure, but I never said there would be only one treasure. That's horrible. Whether it's one treasure or four, what's the difference for a young go-getter like yourself? Since I'm feeling generous, I will also teach you a trick for finding shrines. It's always best to survey the area by looking around from a high point. Let's see here. How about you make your way to the top of that tower again? <laughs> I admire your eagerness, but allow me to teach you something else before you go. Take a look at the map on your Sheikah Slate. I'm probably mispronouncing this totally wrong. See those blue icons? You should recognize the cave where you woke, the shrine you came from, and the tower. You can travel instantly to any of those places with the Sheikah Slate. Hmm. Or so I heard quite some time ago. I do not know if it actually works as such. I have no idea what button to press, so let's just cut to a montage of me taking the scenic route. I don't know if this is how you fish. I really do not want to have to make this climb. Alright. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> well, you certainly took your time. Did you forget how to travel instantly? Now then, I wanted you to join me up here, so you could use this as a vantage point to search for shrines. Yes, I know about the scope of my Sheikah Slate. I think it's Sheikah, is it? Shiaika? Shiaika? I don't know. Hmm. Yeah, how do you know? Just a few tricks I've picked up after many, many years in the wild. You may take my advice or leave it. Go ahead and take a look if you feel inclined to do so. I'm not moving anywhere. Nope, 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 nope. I'm not gonna attack you, old man. What's happening? What? That is awesome.
Boom! <laughs> Gimme! Wow! A traveler's claymore! Wow! Fire in a hole! I don't want to know what that thing is. I had to defeat a monster last time. This probably is going to be another monster. I don't like the sound of that. Oops! My bad! Alright, so I know I gotta throw it. Ha 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 ha! I just don't like the sound of whatever that is over there. Oh, okay. It's not a creature. Oh, I feel better. Here we go. I guess that wasn't needed. Okay, if that's there, there must be something else over there. What goodies do you have for me? An amber! In the name of Goddess Halea, I bestow upon you the Spirit Orb! Oh, it's so shiny! Look at that! Now it's a part of me! Oh. Alright! Time for you to go! May the goddess smile upon you too! Don't forget to subscribe! Going down. Here we go. I got this now. So to do this, you gotta hit the L1 bumper. And then A. To stop it at the right time. Right there. And then you run! Perfect. Oh, we got an extra toy. An iron sledgehammer! This iron sledgehammer was originally used for mining, but it works reasonably well as a weapon too. Ah, this might be able to use a sledgehammer. Ah. 
All right. How do I get that boulder off? Because that's blocking the path. Maybe time's frozen on it? I don't know. Throw it. That did not budge it. Oh, there we go. I did not expect that. Nothing special there. You gotta look. Hello? Knock, knock, knock. Your resourcefulness is overcoming these trials as promise of a hero. I don't know if I said that right. In the name of a goddess, Halea, I bestow upon you this spirit orb. A symbol of courage, give it to those who have overcome the challenges of a shrine. May the goddess smile upon you and subscribe to Cheeseball Gaming. I believe this is where I came from. Let's go get that fourth orb! I'm gonna have some nasty blisters after this run. Drop that icicle. Give me that tear. Come on. Interesting, interesting.
Oh, good. It doesn't hurt me. Good. Nice. I didn't think of that. That was by accident. One hit. I like it. Did I win? Is it over? I got it. Isn't that cool, huh? Any secrets? Secrets, 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 secrets? Nothing. FBI, open up! Thank you. In the name of Goddess Halaya, I bestow upon you the spirit orb. Hey, Slumpy. All right. May the goddess smile upon you. Subscribe to Cheeseball Gaming. Yes, I have. I have collected all the spirit orbs and shrines of this plateau. Uh -huh. Uh, extraordinary. Hmm. That means it is finally time. Link, it is finally time for me to tell you everything. But first, I don't remember telling you my name. Hmm. Imagine an X on your map with the four shrines at the end points. Find a spot where those lines intersect. I shall wait for you there. Ah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I understand. Can't you just give it to me now? Oh, I think he'd be correct, or I'd be correct. I think I'd be correct. This looks different. Oh, yeah. You who have conquered the shrines and claimed the spirit orbs. I can offer you great power. It appears you have claimed four spirit orbs. In exchange for four spirit orbs, I will amplify your being. So tell me what it is that you desire. A heart container? Stay little vessel? Never mind. Uh, I guess a heart container? Yeah. Wow! Thing is so big! Eh. Ho! Ho! Is he gonna come flying again? Uh. 
Okay, I really can't see. Oh, now I see you. I see you. <laughs> Here you are, old man. <laughs> Tell me a story. Well done there, young one. Now then. The time has come to show you who I truly am. I was King Rome Bosphoramus Hyrule. I was the last leader of Hyrule. A kingdom which no longer exists. The Great Calamity was merciless. It devastated everything in its path, lo, a century ago. It was then that my life was taken away from me. And since that time, here I have remained in spirit form. I did not think it wise to overwhelm you while your memory was still fragile. So rather than that, I thought it best to assume a temporary form. Forgive me. I think you are now ready. Ready to hear what happened 100 years ago. To know Calamity Ganon's true form, one must know the story from an age long past. The Demon King was born into this kingdom, but his transformation into malice created the horror you see now. Stories of Ganon were passed from generation to generation in the form of legends and fairy tales. But there was also a prophecy. The signs of a resurrection of Calamity Ganon are clear, and the power to oppose it lies dormant beneath the ground. We decided to heed the prophecy and began excavating large areas of land. It wasn't long before we discovered several ancient relics made by the hands of our distant ancestors. These relics, the Divine Beasts, were giant machines piloted by warriors. We also found the Guardians, an army of mechanical soldiers who fought autonomously. This coincided with ancient legends oft repeated throughout our land. We also learned of a princess with a sacred power and her appointed knight chosen by the sword that seals the darkness. It was they who sealed Ganon away using the power of these ancient relics. One hundred years ago, there was a princess set to inherit a sacred power and a skilled knight at her side. It was clear that we must follow our ancestors' path. We selected four skilled individuals from across Hyrule and tasked them with the duty of piloting the Divine Beasts. With the Princess as their commander, we dubbed these pilots Champions, a name that would solidify their unique bond. The Princess, her appointed knight, and the rest of the champions were on the brink of sealing away Ganon. But nay. Ganon was cunning, and he responded with a plan beyond our imagining. from deep below Hyrule Castle, <laughs> seized control of the Guardians and the Divine Beasts, and turned them against us. The champions lost their lives, those residing in the castle as well. The appointed knight gravely collapsed while defending the princess. And thus, the kingdom of Hyrule was devastated absolutely by Calamity Ganon. However, the princess survived to face Ganon alone. Link. 
You are our final hope. The fate of Hyrule rests with you. That princess was my own daughter, my dear Zelda. And the courageous knight who protected her right up to the very end. That knight was none other than you, Link. You fought valiantly when your fate took an unfortunate turn. And then, you were taken to the Shrine of Resurrection. Here you now stand, revitalized 100 years later. The words of guidance you have been hearing since your awakening are from Princess Zelda herself. Even now, as she works to restrain Ganon from within Hyrule Castle, she calls out for your help. However, my daughter's power will soon be exhausted. Once that happens, Ganon will freely regenerate himself, and nothing will stop him from consuming our land. Considering that I could not save my own kingdom, I have no right to ask this of you, Link. But I am powerless here. You must save her, my daughter, and do whatever it takes to annihilate Ganon. Somehow, Ganon has maintained control over all four divine beasts, as well as those guardians swarming around Hyrule Castle. I believe it would be quite reckless for you to head directly to the castle at this point. I suggest that you make your way east out to one of the villages in the wilderness. Follow the road out to Kakariko Village. There you will find the Elder Impa. She will tell you more about the path that lies ahead. Consult the map on your Sheikah Slate for the precise location of Kakariko Village. Make your way past the twin summits of the Dueling Peaks. From there, follow the road as it proceeds north. Hmm. All right, paraglider time. Woo! <laughs> I told you everything I can. <laughs> <laughs> 